Nithala ji told me today while he was walking that his plan is to get up at 4.30. 4.30. <laughs> <laughs> you know, nobody is calling me. No. In the evening or in the morning? <laughs> I was looking that the walking, at least in the, in the front row, was a little bit like politics. Because every now and then somebody would trip, fall down, then he has to be picked up. <laughs> Championship of the walking is between Hassan and you. But you fell also once. Well, it fell badly, I remember, at the beginning. You failed me. <laughs> <laughs> youngsters are coming in the Lago year, but this Yatra is a thing. Not many youngsters. That is the worrying part of our opponents. Therefore, they are believing that uh, that basically, I believe that you are raising the issue of unemployment also. 15,000, 20,000, 25,000, 30,000, sometimes more than 50,000 people. So, not only single incident uh, happened, hmm. these many crowds came. The people, our workers, very much, you know, yeah. they have adopted a self discipline. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, I don't think others know, but you know that I was having, I'm having knee problem, yeah, yeah. right, while I'm walking. So, while I'm walking, sometimes I'm getting quite bad pain. And I wrote, noticed, whenever I'm finding that difficulty is getting more, then suddenly I'm finding somebody is coming, doing something or telling me something that is removing the difficulty. So, for example, yesterday I was having a very uh, uh, rough time. And then suddenly this girl came and gave me this letter. And I got it in my pocket. And then the girl said here, I mean, she quoted, with hardship, there has to be ease. So suddenly I was thinking, hardship, hardship, hardship. She gave me the letter and it's written, hardship, there has to be ease. I was like, look, somebody is now come and help me in my most difficult time. So, so that I always found that every time I'm having a trouble, somebody from the public or even somebody from you is coming and pulling me out of that trouble. See, I'll tell you what the psychology is. In my case, if you suffer huge amount of violence, right, this happens to you. You cannot suffer huge violence and still believe in violence. It doesn't. So if you suffer huge amount of violence, you automatically are designed to see violence happening against someone. Because you're like, oh, I, I, I felt that. My father died or my grandmother died, whatever. I felt that pain. So I will look when the person is feeling that pain. That I think is the also a huge part of the, the message of the Yatra. My, my understanding, at least in Kerala, I noticed two or three things. One, I noticed that if you go in the towns, mostly you will find local businesses. All these small and medium businesses, they are all having problem. You know, uh, cashew is having problem, coconut is having problem, rubber is having problem, coir is having problem, everybody is having problem. Nobody is actually having a good time. And the other thing I noticed is that a lot of these businesses, they are very dependent on uh, imports. So somebody can do something on that side and your business over here is destroyed. Second thing I noticed is that women are quite uh, confident, aware, they are not insecure. They have quite a powerful role in, in society. I felt the other, the other thing I realized, environment over here is central to the politics. Because you have so little land and because the, there's a lot of population, everything rotates around environment. Environment is very important here. Much more important than uh, in some other states. And people are quite conscious about it. So they know uh, what, are the, what are the issues. Today, Chanitala ji, they gave him a vegetable samosa. I told him, Chanitala ji, this is non-veg samosa. <laughs> but he was keen to try it. <laughs> he was keen to try it. And afterwards, the guy came and Chanitala ji said, listen, is it veg or is it non-veg? For the first time, I heard a new concept. He said, it is half veg, half non-veg. <laughs> Kerala Congress is in safe hands. There's many, many young people who are who I've met now, you know, uh, Panchayat Presidents, Mahila, Mahila Congress, KSU, everywhere, who are solid people and have their heart in the right place. So I'm pretty confident that as long as we do one or two things, what we discussed already, have a plan for 
the future uh, have think about how we bring women into the uh, senior levels of the party think about how we bring youngsters into the party we are tribal dalit communities into the party and i'd also like to thank all of you because frankly this would not have been possible without you you keep saying my name uh, but this would not have been possible without all your support all your hard work and all your personalities and of course uh, i think together we should also thank the people of kerala uh, who have made it possible and and successful thank you